New Yorkers were introduced to the world of 3D printing as a group of startup businesses gathered to show how their services can revolutionize the way we buy products. 3D uh, is a, a pop-up store where we want to show to everybody who wants to visit what the big potential is of 3D printing. You can see 3D printers uh, working their magic and uh, you can see what they can make and uh, you can see what is possible and it's mind-blowing. This new way of making things may change the way we shop, where an item you buy can be one of a kind because you made it. With 3D printing, what it enables you is to make any item, even if it's only once, at a reasonable price. Personalization, customization becomes then really relevant. You know, you can make something with someone's name on it, or you can put someone's face on, on, a, on a coffee mug. Basically, your imagination becomes your only limitation in finding this perfect gift for the person you care about. The way you go about designing products is by using online, easy-to-use 3D software. You can customize items with great detail, to the point of cropping your own face on an item you want to make. You go from a digital description like a Word file, but then in 3D, to a physical product. Not a piece of paper with some words on it, but an actual physical thing you can touch. One way to more naturally design 3D products is with 3D scanning. The 3D scanning company ShapeShot says they have introduced one of the first 3D scanning photo booths. <laughs> it's tough being a star. Uh, ShapeShot photo booth should be really easy. You just sort of line yourself up. It's a leapboard of just a touch. A little bit more. There you go. That's actually good. Whenever you're ready, you can hit that flashing red button and take your picture. And the really great thing about this is it's so fast. So it's the time of the flash. It's just like taking a picture. It's similar to photography in that you get to sort of almost catch a moment. Once we have the pictures, the first step is to make those pictures into a 3D model. You can actually see it's a really realistic rendering of not just the picture, but also the shape of the person. The body scanning is a completely separate scanner. It's actually really easy to use. It works almost like a video camera. And what we do is as we go up and down and we sort of scan just like a video camera, we're scanning frame after frame after frame after frame. So every shot, you get a whole panel of 3D data, and then post-processing it, put all of the scans together into one coherent model. And then, you know, maybe within an hour, you could have the button pushed and ready to go to print. not just the scanning that we're getting really good at and the 3D printing that we're getting really good at, but there's this whole thing in the middle, which is how do I take the scan, which is a really nice little interesting object to begin with, but it's not useful yet. If we can open up the, the use of this data to the right people, then they can develop their own applications around it. Startup company New York Toy Collective discovered a way to use both 3D scanning and printing to make your personal life even more personalized. We can actually scan your very own body parts and turn them into a body safe silicone toy. Well, it's kind of like the premium level of sex toy, you know, it's yeah. the ultimate in personalized um, toys. So it's people that uh, kind of want to satisfy their curiosity a little bit, maybe stroke their ego a little bit, yeah. you know, and maybe impress like a special friend. 3D printing, how is it relevant to you? That's the next question that we all want to answer. Way back in the beginning, almost no one had heard about 3D printing. And I think what is starting to happen is that we're now at this tipping point where it's starting to become something that most people have heard about. And then you start to investigate and at some point you go like, ha, I want to use this as well because I have this need, I have this problem that I want to solve and this new technology enables me to do it.